moving to another apartment. Okay, this is nowhere near the size of the move that I did, gosh, two and a half years ago to make it across the pond. No, we um, have decided for a few reasons that I will go over that it's time for a change. And to be honest with you, I feel really like bittersweet about it. Like I, I like the new apartment and there will be an apartment tour um, probably buried in this video, but I just, I love this building. I love the staff. The staff are amazing. Like I will get packages and if one particular doorman is on duty, it will say Cassie two dollar signs on it. Um, the same particular doorman keeps on top of my subscribers and is like, you're at 155,000. Like those small things that are just, there have been a number of times where I've been having like a bad day and I've literally come home or I've gone to collect packages and you know, the staff have put a smile on my face. So yes, it is bittersweet, but the new place has more space. So that's great. There are two walk-in wardrobes. I have generously given one to me um, that I will also put the luggage and like home stuff in. So it's not quite, it's an upgrade from what he's currently got. And I'm excited about sort of the second bedroom as it is here is like my filming slash wardrobe space. So same thing in the other one, except it's bigger and there's also a walk-in. So I am also going to rope Christian in, um, whether against or with his will, <laughs> to help me sort of like do it properly, make it work for me and all of that. Uh, it's We're also moving to a quieter area because being a couple of blocks away from Times Square, there's some noise that comes with that. I, <laughs> I will say like, Two days after we signed the new lease, somebody's car alarm went off all night. And I am in no way exaggerating when I tell you it was all night. I don't know what was going on. I don't know if there was, I'm assuming that there was some sort of something wrong with the car, right? Because I'm sorry, if somebody has been trying to break in for the last six hours and he's not done, give up, give up right? I mean, it, I, I could do it in less than six hours and I'm not a professional. Anyway, we've gone down a path, but yes, um, there can be a lot of traffic and all of that. And, um, I don't think we're going to have the same issue in the new area. So yeah, we're growing up. Ugh, the worst. So without a doubt, this is going to be a far less stressful move than my last one was, which was <laughs> carrying 10 pieces of luggage on the flight and off the flight and shipping 10 boxes over here. But uh, it is still, what is it? What are the statistics is one of the most stressful things is moving and I'm trying to keep the stress levels low, all right? My cortisol levels are already through the roof through, I think, just existing. Um, I'm a worrier by nature. So I'm trying to have as, as, least, <laughs> as, least, as less of a stressful move as possible. We are having movers and they are also doing the packing. I will also be doing some of the packing myself. So like, that's gonna be some of this video. Like I'm gonna pack my bags, jewelry, those sorts of things into suitcases, but everything else is going to be packed by something. And I've never had such a service. So I almost feel a bit useless because I'm like, I'm filming this the weekend before I move and I move on a Tuesday. Okay, so we are T minus four days. And I am, I, I'm just here like twiddling my thumbs. I'm like, this isn't normal, like I should be doing something. So I'm going to basically pack, let me show you. These bags need to be packed today. This is what's in the frame of my videos and I still have to film three videos on Monday. So those will stay up and then I'll do the rest Monday afternoon. You see, these can all be packed down here. You're seeing how the sausage is made and it's all over the place. And then I think that I will also pack in these drawers. What's in these drawers, Cassie? Excellent question. We've got accessories, belts, costume, jewelry, sunglasses. I did some, I did a box of like boxes, essentially. You know, when people are like, oh, what do you do with all your boxes when you buy things? Some of them I keep, some of them I bin. I did a box of boxes and I put in some of the sunglasses and then this is all dust bags that my mum, the last time she was here, painstakingly organized, so. Shout out to her. I'm really trying to progress today, which is the long and short of it. So I just want to show you this new bin that I bought myself. I thought that it was the perfect bin for my room in the flat. It's, it's a metal shopping, that's brilliant, isn't it, Jelly? Oh, 
I love it. It was, it was more than a bin should be, but it was on sale. So I will take my winnings somewhere. Okay, Cassie, come on. You may be thinking, why don't you let me do this? Listen, oddly enough, I am a very hands-on woman. Contrary to what my nails suggest, I do like somewhat getting down and dirty. Ha! Ah. Success. Right, Jackie, it's my prides and joys. I am very much a jacket girl. I really am. Oh, come on. That one looks like jelly. Oh, also, these are really helpful. Clearly, I um, this one needs to be discarded. But it basically gets all of the all of the moisture out of your areas. You can put it in wardrobes, any of that. I just get them on Amazon. Oh, oh, bit of the old razzle dazzle. Good afternoon, boss. Don't you dare, fit, don't you dare. My love, I love you. And you're usually so good and so gentle with everything in all of my bags, aren't you? But one thing that I've caught you doing once or twice is launching yourself from here onto the top of the jackets and that's got to stop, my love. Okay, so I'm trusting you. I'm turning my back now. Okay, I don't need to be... You need to prove that you're responsible. Okay, look at that. Mm. Look at that jelly. Very beautiful. Success, Jelly. Look at us. Look at us whizzing through things. Okay. Turn it around. Turn the beat in. Cushion. Bop, 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 bop. While I do have a lot of black jackets, they all have wildly different personalities. Cardigan with shoulder pads, why aren't we seeing that more? That's my question. Love of my life, really. Oh. I think that is going to be the most that we're getting in here. progress. Now another thing that happens when I get stressed is that my skin follows suit and I don't like to play those games. And one of the ways that I'm trying to get ahead of that is with today's video sponsor, Current Body. Everybody say hello to Veronica. Also, I have a code. This is the biggest discount that you will ever get off this year. You might sit here and go, the last time you showed us Veronica, she looked a bit different. Yes, this is the series one that I showed you last time. Current Body have just launched series two. Since I've started using LED masks, I pretty much use them every day. You can use them three to five times a week to really like see results, but I just, it's such a core part of my self-care routine now. Like I put it on before I go to bed, I'm sat there with my Kindle. It's glorious. The biggest difference I saw, and that was within 30 days of using the uh, LED mask, was evenness of skin tone. Here's a little before and after after 30 days, and then this is my skin today, right? No makeup, just skincare. That has continued a decreasing in redness. LED masks are also supposed to help with fine lines, wrinkles, minimizes pores as well. And I must say, I am extracting a lot less blackheads than I was before. Now, one of the main differences between Veronica 1 and Veronica 2 is the face shape. Okay, obviously she's curved, she's not. Um, apologies for the shrieks if you have any children watching this. There's a difference in fit. And then you just press your handy dandy button and she times out after 10 minutes. 10 minutes is the treatment um, length. Also, the difference in face shape does not change how portable this is. Like this is easy to pack. This is easy to just roll up, put it in its bag, pack it in the corner of your luggage. And one thing in particular that I like about series two is that this has Veritas, which basically means that with the mask comes this little card. And if you take the card, aha, and you hold it near to your phone, do you see that little drop down? It will tell you all of the testing for your particular mask. So component sourcing, LED selection process, and all of the tests that the LEDs passed, right? So you can have confidence in your product, okay? And I don't think that we think about these things enough, especially when it comes to skincare. My code is Cassie T, all capitals. That will get you 20% off selected current body products, but it works on Veronica 2 and it works on series one as well. So this is your time if you've ever 
ever been tempted, if you've ever been intrigued by an LED mask, to give them a try. Thank you so much to Current Body for sponsoring this part of the video. How do you enjoy my tattered up suitcase? Do you want to be packed up as well? Is that what's going on here? I'm going to keep these lying down until the day of the move so that it minimizes the amount of time that the bags are actually going to be on top of each other. But for that time, I want to make sure that the ones that can withstand the load are on uh, towards the back. Now, this is my current progress. Okay. This one I'm kind of worried about because what happens with the Miwar hate is that when it like cracks, it cracks, you can see it. So I'm going to attempt to stuff her so that she can keep her shape a little bit more. Listen, sometimes that is engaged. Get in there. So you're going slap bang in the middle. You're going right here. Fantastic. Let me put some down here actually. There we go. Perfect. Down the side. Dust bags. I'm not sure this is the most exciting content for you. It's taking it out of me, honestly. I've not even done that much. It's the physical exhaustion, you know, I don't really exert myself physically a lot. Honestly, my back's hurting. Is this what 31 is? Sanjay, that's Ta-da! Here she is. Gosh, this was a 2015 moment, was it not? Spring, summer 2015, Lady Gaga was the campaign star. Oh, fantastic. This was part of my 21st birthday gift and apparently my mum went everywhere to get this sodding harness for me. Shout out to my mother. Obsessed with her. I found a receipt. Unica Colana Metallo. Okay, so I think this was the necklace. Wow, 430 pounds for costume. 430 pounds for costume jewelry for a necklace like that. Those were the days. Was it 2015? I lied. I was 21 in 2014. A legend, an icon, Jack. My dad called him Jack because he's one-eyed Jack. One eye fell out. And with that, last night, how are you feeling? Great. Oh, look at you. Everything is everywhere. I still need to put some of these away because I'll wear some of this tomorrow and then those are my sleep socks, so. You got a good look in there. These are going to be the bags that are going to be by my side tomorrow. This and obviously these bad boys. So this is all going to go. Laptop will go in there as well. All my lighting. I'm going to miss this little view. Not that you can see much of it. That flat always used to watch BBC News all the time. They've got the biggest TV I've ever seen. Christian used to live here. Great view of the Volvo car the dealership this is the state of my closet now and we will see how that goes tomorrow we've got these set up here watching power don't ask we've already seen it it's the acting's awful da -da -da -da. suitcases done this was the pool that i used to be jealous of every summer and just see people having a great time down there and me not being there. <sighs> I'm gonna miss that jealousy. I am. A cacophony of traffic, and it's so convenient that on the last night we're here, there's no sound. But such is life. How are you feeling? Yeah, she's got no idea what's happening, but she knows that something's happening. Oh, jelly. Good morning. This launching is awful. Um, it is 6.23 on move day. Uh, the movers are going to be here by 7 and I am quickly going to get a bagel from our like deli uh, and a smoothie as well. Morning. Morning. I'm going to go fuel myself. Look how dark it is still outside. Oh my gosh, the sky looks beautiful. Going to get an everything bagel with green cheese. Toasted. I think I will get myself a coffee. Yes, because I have been up since 2.30. You know, like, it's the same feeling before you go on holiday. Like, all of a sudden, now is the time when every anxiety and woe in my life decides to come up. 
and then I spend hours going through every situation and then eventually my mind just goes oh sod it and just sort of like lay there awake so I was like oh, great well let me let me get up and get going start my day oh my gosh look at Times Square for a minute of here you can see it in the distance all of the lights <laughs> They're so cute. Update. So, I would say like 90% of everything is packed. There's a team of four, and they just got straight down to business. They were like, no ifs, ands, or buts. Is everything packed being packed? Yeah, great, we're on it. So, let me get, I mean like, this whole room is done. Jelly is cautious, but also curious. So, she's having a look where she wants to. The IKEA packs is all wrapped up, ready to go. Everything is packed. Everything's in boxes. I mean, honestly, I feel like we could have sodded off for a couple of hours and then uh, come back. I suppose I can now do my sentimental bit. It was funny because yesterday, I feel like I haven't really had the time to be emotional about this move because you know me. I'm sensitive, I cry. I've got, I've got too many of the emotions. But, like last night we were talking and it's like, oh my gosh, this is obviously the first apartment that we moved into to New York. It's where I hit 100,000 subscribers. It's, you know, we were living here when we got engaged, when we did our courthouse marriage, when we got jelly. It's, um, it's been, it's given us a lot. It's given us a lot and, I'm so grateful for it and I hope that whoever's next in here experiences lots of good things as well. But yeah, but new things, <sighs> a change. Look, I'm, I'm happy about the new place I am, but you know, it's just, it's bittersweet. We're in, we're packed up, we're meeting the movers at the new place and someone did a really good job. If you can see her, she's back here. She's shy, she's sleepy, she hasn't had her afternoon nap, she hasn't had her late morning nap. Poor girl. Whole routine's been thrown today. But she did a great job. I was going to do this when, like, as we'd moved in, but I'm actually here just measuring up, so I sort of thought, well, let's do it now then. So, you walk in, this is the entryway, and then there's this area here where I want to put, like, a console table and, you know, stuff like that. Then we walk down here, a luxury in-unit washer and dryer. Wow. I can't even remember what that's like and not having to go downstairs to do it. Closet number one, okay? We have this little nook area here, which obviously could be nothing. Or I feel like, you know, something could go here, just even like a little, a little something. Now I'm trying to be better when it comes to interiors. As we know, it's not my forte. Here lies the kitchen. Fridge, blah, 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 microwave, all of that. The island situation. Then we have bathroom number one. This will be mine. What is that lighting looking like? Oh, medicine cabinet. Okay, this will be my products and things. Ginormous mirror. Da -da 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 bath. Little storage cabinet over here. Then this will be my filming room. Okay, hold on. I've given you a sneak peek into there. So, this is the room. Lots of space, lots of light, crucially. The walk-in wardrobe. This this was the clincher to me. This was the deal maker. Glorious. All of my boxes <laughs> will go across the top. It'll be fantastic. Does this hold? Does this hold a lot of weight? Because it's going to need to. Then we go across here to the master. Da -da -da -da. Got all the heating and whatnot. This is and again. Also another little closet. We have got space for everything. But the question is, how does one organize the space, right? So that's that. And another walk-in. 
I have been a lovely wife and I have gifted me this space. However, if I run out of space, I shall be coming here. And then the final bathroom. So there's obviously a lot more space than we currently have, did have, not sure when this video is going to come out, but I'm excited about it. I'm excited about making this feel a little bit more cosy, I think. That's why I'm kind of taking the interiors slightly more seriously than I ever have done. Um, oh, great excuse to get a new couch, because you know I hate my current couch. Again, I don't know anything about interiors. Nobody told me boucle isn't meant for every day. Okay, so that couch looks 10 years old. It's two. It's terrible. And also, like, the inside of it is caving in. Anyway, it's a terrible, terrible couch. It's the Strata couch from CB2. Nobody should get it. Jelly will love it because there's so much space for her to run around and so many cupboards for her to go inside of. The move went well. Everything went well. We're in. I am pretty much done. There's just, like some more home pieces that I want to add and I will probably do another vlog sort of going into like more of the homey stuff I guess if anybody's interested um I've got a giant frog from Jonathan Adler I love him his name's Franklin but anyway I will also be doing a video going into more depth about organization of the closet what we've decided to do in there Christian's expertise getting used. So I'm excited to sort of show you how we've done it. Hopefully it makes sense. Make a bit of my own closet tour. You know, I haven't done one in a while uh, and we've got something new to play with. So yeah, thus far I'm liking it here. It's quiet. It's a bit more like families and stuff like that, which is cute. Jelly is settling in. She didn't eat for three days. She would only eat treats woman after my own heart um but she is eating normally and she's fine and she was just uh being dramatic so that's that i hope you enjoyed this video don't forget to check out current body if you're interested and use my code to get yourself the best deal that you can get i'm going to leave a link to another video over here in case you haven't already seen it have an amazing morning afternoon or evening wherever you are and in the words of my father if you've enjoyed it tell your friends if you haven't keep your mouth shut see you in my next video Mwah. bye guys